Illinois men's golf starts the NCAA regionals Monday morning. They're in search of their 12th NCAA championship appearance in a row. I caught up with them before they left for Myrtle Beach to find out how Mike Small has turned Illinois into a second home for one small European country. More than 4,000 miles separate Champaign, Illinois and Brussels, Belgium. Mike Small has never been there, but he's got four of the best golfers from the country to travel halfway around the world to play for him. When they spread positive things, kids want to replicate that and they want to come live the, you know, kind of experience it themselves. And that's where Adrian Dumont de Chassar comes into the picture. He saw the success of Thomas Peters, Thomas Dietrich, and Giovanni Tadiotto and didn't even consider another school. Since I'm 14, 15, I knew I wanted to come here. Okay. I've been in touch with Coach like for, say, four years now, and I was not really looking at any other university at that time. Belgium is so small that it's hard to have tons of good players, but what Illinois has done for the previous Belgian players increase the desire of any Belgian players to actually come here. It's not the first time the two have been on the course together. They grew up only miles apart in Belgium while playing on the same junior circuit. We traveled together for European tournaments, international tournaments, and then he came to the same high school as me. Dumont de Chassar is quickly making his own name with the Illini. He won individual medalist honors at the Big Ten Championships, the third of the four Belgians to win. It just like feels good to you represent Illinois, but also like represent Belgium. Small thinks it's only the start of what's to come for the freshman. He's the kind of guy that if you need the, the ball in basketball the, you know, in his hands at the end of the game, or if he's a quarterback, you'd want him there, or a golfer, you want him playing that last round. He's that kind of guy. He's that silent assassin that once he becomes better fundamentally, he's going to be really good. That's the scary part. There are no seniors on this Illinois team, so the future remains bright for the orange and blue.